FB tweet. Pinterest email send text message print. Mori Pippon has a vision. The alum shared a little bit about her upcoming wedding to Kenny Brosh in a recent conversation with Mike Johnson and Brian Abbasolo on the Talking It Out podcast. Pippon, 26, confirmed the couple hasn't set a date yet but is in the planning phase of their wedding. We agreed that we're gonna do it in Puerto Rico, definitely, she said. I have a lot of extended family there, grandparents, cousins, aunts, uncles, everybody, so, we're all gonna meet up there in Puerto Rico. While their destination is set, the venue is still up for debate, according to Pippon. I have narrowed it down to, I think, four venues now. We haven't gone to see them all in person just yet, she explained. But I've seen the pictures online and I really want to do something outdoors for the ceremony and something indoors for the party. Pippon said she's also having a tough time making decisions about the details of the big day. We were on this amazing trip that was all about getting into that process of wedding planning and getting ideas. Oh my gosh, I have so many ideas now, she said. I thought I already had a ton of ideas cause I have a whole Pinterest board dedicated to this, but now I'm like I want that color. I want this cake, but I want that cake, too. It's a mess. The one thing she is sure about? bringing Puerto Rico's tropical environment into her wedding design. I know that I want, a, tropical theme, she shared. Tropical flowers, nice and colorful. So, that's where we're at so far. As for Brosh, 40, the pawn joked her fiancé has been very much like, you do what you want, I will show up. accepted a proposal from Brosh on season 7 of. Though they left the season engaged, it wasn't entirely smooth sailing for the couple. The pawn and Brosh split briefly and pursued other people but eventually found their way back together after having an honest conversation about their feelings. In October, Brosh told people he doesn't regret the time they spent apart. There were a lot of things going on, but at the end of the day, everything that happened put us where we are right now. So it's all good, he said.